Yeah! And when you're hungry, what do you do? Okay, this is a dumb intro. guys welcome back to my channel i'm really happy that you're here we're trying something new today if you know anything about me you know that i do not spend time in the kitchen and so what better way than to start off the relaunch of my youtube channel than to have you watch me fail at this failure is scary okay you have to just go for it i found myself with a hello fresh meal we're gonna cook together would you journey with me yeah, well, you're here. Okay, so let's dive in. Okay, we are making cheesy smothered mushroom chicken. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of mushrooms, but I am assuming that there is some sort of sauce. And, um, cheese, very important. Scallions, carrots. On the side, there's creamy mashed potato. We're gonna mash these potatoes. Mashed potatoes from scratch, never done that before. Check that off my bucket list. Step one, preheat oven to 425 degrees. Good. Wash and dry produce. Thinly sliced mushrooms. It just looks like I went out into the weeds and grabbed this and go, hmm, I wanna put this in my face. Ugh. Cooking. Jamie Lynn in the kitchen? Unheard of. Also this carrot, feels like what would be the perfect carrot for a snowman, missed opportunity. This is, look at another missed opportunity for a snowman. Too bad I live in a place where it doesn't snow. I just feel like I have to document the mushroom stuff because I don't like mushrooms. It says to thinly, ew, oh, they're mushy. They're mushy. You didn't tell me they were gonna be mushy. Ooh, ooh, they're slimy. Ooh, you guys. I literally was about to be like, it looks like fungus. It is fungus. Somehow it's safe fungus to eat. Oh, ugh. What does a clean mushroom look like? How do you cut mushrooms? How do you cut them? <gasps> oh, I don't like it. Um, okay, trust the process. I literally feel like I want to gag. <laughs> Are you having fun yet? Because <laughs> uh, I sure am. You guys, cutting scallions makes me feel like a chef. Yes, chef, Jay, Jay, boom, Lego. We're on step two. Toss carrots on a baking sheet with a drizzle, drizzle of oil, salt, and pepper. What is a drizzle? I'm gonna do a drizzle and then you let me know in the comments. Oh, oh I got it on my sweatshirt. <laughs> Oh, I should probably put the carrots in first. Okay, here you go. Take a nice oil bath. It's good for your skin. This feels like a little bit more than a drizzle, but we're going with it. Into the oven she goes. Set a timer for 25 minutes. Gosh, I'm hungry. This takes so long. I got a little baby potato. I should have washed my hands before I started, huh? Um, in other news, I've had some fun cutting these potatoes. If someone were to have dropped a potato in the trash can, that would be funny. It wasn't me. It wasn't me. It was a friend of mine. But if if my friend um, dropped a potato in the trash can while she was peeling it, like what would be the protocol? I mean, I know, but I'm just testing you guys. So comment below, like what would be the protocol if you dropped a potato in the trash can? Again, it was not me. Recipe calls for a large pan, a large pan. Pot, sorry, pot. I know the difference, I do. And we're gonna put all the potatoes inside the pot, yeah. Here we go, don't fall. Oh, was not the most effective way to do that. It counts, five second roll. I am correctly boiling the potatoes. Voice. Oh look, oh, some potatoes missed. Go back with their family. As they boiled to death. Okay, what excellent boiled potatoes. Name that movie. Name it, comment it. Okay, the, the step, step, step three. Wild potatoes cook, pat chicken dry with paper towels. Also there's like, there's like liquid. Ew. Oh, it's, oh, it's super slimy. Oh, that's everywhere. Oh. 
How much padding do you need? Do you need to be told you're doing a good job? Good job. I'm braving it. Ugh. We're going in for the chicken. We're going in. I think I put too much oil. Ah. Uh. Oh, oh my goodness, it's slow. Oh my gosh. Oh, I need these, right? I'm having fun, are you having fun? Oh my god! I'm getting scared. Ready to flip, ow. Oh yeah, it's already like burnt on that side. Okay, these are cooking real fast. Oh my gosh! This is dangerous! Okay, I know what a drizzle of oil is now, it's not this. And in the midst of this chaos, the carrots are done. Burned, not burned, is that the color we're supposed to be going for? I don't know. Okay, this is this is boiling now. We may be failing here, but that's okay, because we're learning and we're not afraid. It says cook until browned and cooked through. I'd say that's pretty brown and it's cooked through, okay? Ugh. I've started eating the carrots because I'm hungry. That's why I don't cook, you guys. Okay, potatoes are drained. It calls for a low heat and a tablespoon of butter. There you go. Great job, everyone. Time to mush. Eh? It doesn't say to put milk in, but I put some milk in and make it creamy. This is so many mushrooms. I don't want to put that many mushrooms in there. Uh, oh well. You guys don't want to miss out on this, right? Yummy mushrooms. Adding butter. This doesn't look great, guys. Let me show you. It doesn't look great. Like the the butter is not mixing well. Maybe too much oil. But look, we walked in knowing that failure was a possibility, and. You know what? That's okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is the grand finale. Step six, continue to heat that. We're gonna add the chicken to it and spoon the sauce over it. Also, my carrots are completely cold now because I did it too early or I'm taking too long. I don't know. Spooning the sauce over it. See? Yummy mushrooms over the good chicken. He's saucy. Hey, check that out. Melts in the cheese. Got those, the carrots are over here. They're gonna be popped in the microwave for a second because they're gold. <laughs> burn my hand, burn my hand from the microwave. Didn't see that one coming, did we? Look at these. Ooh, hot carrots. Yeah, they're hot. Chicken with sort of melted cheese. I think I'm just impatient at this point. Okay, come look, come watch. Get some mushrooms in there, Jamie Lynn. Yep, get those mushrooms. Then we are topping with scallions, which are my favorite. We're gonna put some cheese over here, and some over here. It's not cooking unless you just do a whole thing of shredded cheese in your mouth. Okay, and then I also saved some sour cream. Dollop of sour cream right on top. Here is our final meal, ladies and gentlemen. Should we give it a go? We know the carrots are good. I'm gonna try the potatoes with the gravy. Got scallions and cheese. Let's put some sour cream in there to cover up the mushrooms. Okay. I say you can taste the mushrooms like 17% and I say that's a win. Chicken, why did I get a spoon? Chicken is good. All right, guys, we did it. Hello, Fresh. Thank you for cooking with JJ and joining us on this semi-success, okay? There's failure along the way, but we pushed through and we journeyed. I challenge you to go do something that you are scared to do, that you're not good at, but you wanna learn, um, and then go fail. You saw many failures here, okay? We're just gonna keep failing through life 
and we can't have success without failing. You miss 100% of the shots you don't take. Michael Scott said that, but someone else said it before him. Okay, I'm hungry, so bye. The worst part about cooking is cleaning up. These mushrooms are going straight in the trash. Bye, Felicia!